Hi and welcome to my playhouse and today it's very noisy. Uh, the weather has been fantastic here in Denmark in more or less the last week so the temperature is really high which means that the data center has become more warm. So um, right now I'm blowing in air from the outside to, um, to cool the servers and right now the door is open here it really shouldn't be so it's it's kind of cold air comes up in front of the servers goes through the server and out the back but um, as I've had my uh, my ceiling done out here the moving the air part away from the data center isn't really up and running so I need to do some more work there but I had something that we didn't get done I have a student server down here which is turned off at the moment. He, uh, he shuts it off every weekend so that I can save power. It's kind of a power hungry bugger. Yeah, turning it off when he's not using it saves me a bit of money. But when I mounted that, I didn't have the rails for it. So we put it on some slides in there. And now I have the rails. One of them are here. So we're gonna be putting that in. Also, I wanted to put in a GPU in it and um, as I took these out again these are some GPUs with no screen output because they're just meant for the compute power and uh, there is one x16 slot in the server so I thought that we could put this one in it only uses a 6 pin connection and um, I kind of had one of those I wasn't sure that it would be long enough but I actually think that it might actually have been long enough but I was also waiting for power cables to come in from China and they did come in just the day after that I found my secret stash of other power cables that I didn't know that I had but was tucked away in a case full of screen cables so um, yeah now I definitely have enough I bought so many of these that I have actually put them up on my little shop so uh, do go check that out if you're in need of a power cable for a GPU and I bought plenty um, they were like two months on the way so that was irritating we should go and disconnect the server put in the rails put it back in and then we'll go put the GPU in there so here we are on the back of the server and I can't see what I'm doing but I'm gonna disconnect power from it there two leads there and we have some network cables there and I believe that was about it so um, very easy to um, to disconnect I screwed this in need to find a screwdriver it's out again So on 2U servers, uh, IBM servers, the rails are normally in the, at the bottom. Let's see, this one goes, that's the, we need the other one. And that's not the case with this 4U server. It, uh, the rails needs to go somewhere in the middle, but where? Now this looks about right. How far is that? I think that's probably due up. Hmm. Okay, let's hope so. Here are the label if someone uh, suddenly needs to buy some rails for an IBM X3850 X5. So that's uh, 68U7282. So to put these in, there is this tab here that you, you push up and this comes out. And then um, you can put the rails in here and you can press that in like that. And, and that means that it's gonna be sitting on that one and that one so let's try that uh, luckily it's really easy to remove it it's easy to, to put it in um, of course when I have the server up there and tries to mingle this in it's gonna be a drag okay putting this in is not gonna be fun it's heavy can we make it lighter
okay, it's in. With a little luck, it will it will slide in the rack. Uh, there we are. Let's see. doesn't go very well. Okay, the rails in the back was um, was down one level or one one of these thinkies too much. Um, so now it slides a lot better. But we might as well put that GPU in while we have it out. So let's take the cover off here. So we have the PCI Express uh, expansion port right here. There is one X16 and then the six X8. So we are of course putting the GPU in there. And down here, right there, is the power for the GPU. You can kind of see two connections. It's they are they are located on a weird angle in here. So uh, yeah, I think we can use that six pin connector. That one is right here. So let's pop that in. I think that's the easiest thing to to do that right now. Ah, uh, there's not a lot of room. Let's just admit that. There, power. And let's have the GPU it's here, so that power can just go up here. I think that cable is fine. That's. I should have done that days ago, weeks ago. And then we can just pop this in. Um, yeah, the cable is great. Uh, okay, need to make some adjustments here. Oh no. Nah. Chilly so hot out here that I just had a drop from my face land on the server. Luckily on the metal here, but uh, yeah. Um, ruin the airflow and you get in trouble out here. Ooh, it's getting hot. Mainly it's the folding at home that is running. And we are doing really good at folding at home. If you're not on the team, you should check it out. We just entered top 200 yesterday. Okay, I couldn't fit the lead bag on here because it was conflicting with this cable. I couldn't figure that out. I thought it was deep enough. But it has this plastic thing over here. We're taking that out. See if that will work for us. So, try that again. Way better. There we are. Holy moly, let's get this in place again. So this uh, insulation foam is here to prevent the hot air from back of the racks to get in front of the racks so that the servos will not just um, go in a circle here. So what happens now is that the, the air from out here goes through the server, goes up, goes to the back and then it is pumped out through this hole on the other side of the door. And uh, yeah, that should go that way, but it, it doesn't right now. Just look at me, I'm sweating like a pig here. It's, it gets so hot when I take uh, that out of there and the air just turns around. Now it's, it's a lot better already. Air comes in here under the, well, down here underneath the shelves from the shadow side of the house cold-ish air it's uh, I think it's 25 degrees outside so cold-ish and then goes through the server and 35 40 degrees hot air goes out and uh, yeah whacking we melt in the Sun the server is ready for the student to play with Monday and um, still I have a lot of um, GPU power cables if you are in need server good server stuff and just for the sake of it, join me over at Patreon where I do a weekly update video. I'm going to be doing that tomorrow where um, you get a five to seven minutes long
talk where I just tell you what I've been up to. Lately it's not much, it has been so hot, you can see. This was literally a half hour video and I can go and change this shirt. So, but you get an update and you get a bit more interaction over there. I reply to all the comments and you can, and you can privately chat with me over there. So, um, go check out my store, check out these cables. And if you're in need of other hardware, check out Bargain Hardware, where you get 5% off your purchase if you check out with the code MYPLAYHOUSE, small letters. <laughs> Corona. I think that's about it. Oh, no, like this video. Thank you very much for watching my videos. Do subscribe to my channel so you can see me again. And have a really nice day. Bye-bye.